The BMC Team Machine SLR01 is a beautiful mixture of lightweight, comfort, and race-like handling. For 2016, BMC added some paint to the SLR01, causing some of the engineers to freak out. To help combat that, we have the Special Edition Impact Lab. Here to walk us through that is BMC's Thomas McDaniel. Thomas, what's special about this bike behind us? Um, you pointed it out pretty well. There was a bit of a, a tremor, an earthquake in the building whenever we talked about the 2016 lineup having a Team Machine SLR01 fully painted. This is a first for BMC. What's, what's wrong with paint? <laughs> it's heavy. I mean, it, it really is... Uh, it really is a point of pride in the company that our Team Machine SLR01 790 gram frame. And that's not easy to accomplish. It took two years to get to that, um, but it also took a long time to get to a 790 gram weight and make it comfortable. So a lot of times you get really light, really stiff bikes, but they're not much fun to ride for more than an hour. So it's a great lunch ride bike, but we really wanted a bike that you're happy to hop on for five, six hours a day, like our pro team demands. It's not the lightest bike in the world, it's not the stiffest bike in the world, not the most comfortable bike in the world, but it is the best blend of all three. So 790 grams was incredibly difficult to accomplish. So when you tell an engineer that you're going to slap 120 grams of paint, that's disappointing. To keep our engineers happy, because they do such good work, we've decided that we would go to the opposite end of the spectrum and do a Team Machine SLR-R1 with essentially no paint and it's exclusively a clear coat with then a hand finish applied, keeping the bike as absolutely light as possible. We're gonna do 80 units around the world. Availability will be coming much more clear around the holiday season, so it's kind of a Christmas special bike. Um, gives people something to kind of look forward to in the middle of the season at the Northern Hemisphere. It's like, hey, something to get your juices flowing for road bikes. Um, but the bike is hand finished at our impact lab at the headquarters in Switzerland. And because quality is so high, quantity just has to come down. And the graphics are very subtle. That's a, a departure for BMC. Yeah, I think in the past uh, two years, our graphics department is really starting to look at um, how unique our bikes look without any graphics at all. And so we're starting to say, let's let the bike language speak for itself. We don't need flashy uh, artwork. We don't really need anything except a logo and try to keep things as minimal as possible and let the unique design language of a BMC do its thing. So this is even more minimal. We have even fewer logos. Um, it's really hard to see at the black on black, but if you take the bike out into the sun, you can tell that even the artwork itself is less prominent on the frame. Beautiful looking bike. Thanks, Thomas. You bet.